Hello everyone. In this presentation, we will be talking about Parthenium hysteroforus. It is commonly known as Parthenium wheat, mugwort, and more. It belongs to the family Esteraceae under the group Dicot. Habit or life cycle. It is an annual herb. It occurs in wastelands, vacant lands, orchards, forest lands, floodplains, agricultural areas, scrub or shrub lands, urban areas, overgrazed pastures, and along roadsides and railway tracks. It is native to Mexico, Central, South America, and the Caribbean. It is widely distributed to many other countries, including Bhutan. Parthenium hysteroforus is an erect, much branched, with vigorous growth habit, aromatic, annual herbaceous plant with a deep taproot. Leaves They are pale green and lobed. They are strongly dissected and are up to 30 cm in length. Are alternate, sessile, irregularly dissected, and bipinnate. Leaves are hairy and initially forming a basal rosette close to the soil. They have small hairs on both the sides resembling the leaves of carrot. Stems Mature stems are greenish. They become much branched at maturity. They are longitudinally grooved and covered in small stiff hairs. Flower Flower heads are both terminal and axillary, pedunculate and slightly hairy. They are composed of many florets formed into small white capitula and 3 to 5 mm in diameter. The fruit is sipsilla. Seeds Seeds or akins are black, flattened and about 2 mm long, each with two thin, straw-colored, spatulate appendages or sterile florets at the apex which act as air sacs and aid dispersal. The seeds are mainly dispersed through water currents, animals, and the movements of vehicles, machinery, livestock, grain, stock feed, and other produce, to a lesser extent by the wind. Most of the long distance spread is through vehicles, farm machineries, and flooding. Concern or impact on introduction. They are aggressive colonizer of disturbed ground. They possess allelopathic properties. They are reported to cause yield loss in vegetable crops and forage crops. Inhibits fruit setting. They are health hazardous to livestock and human. It acts as a reservoir for necrosis virus and as a host of plant thrips which spreads the virus to peanuts.